George, the next category is for best foreign film. Now, I don't want to seem unworldly or unsophisticated or anything, but this is the American Academy, right? Why is it important for us to give an award to the best foreign film? Well, think of it this way. Remember what foreign films have done for us in the last 20 years alone. They've given us directors like Ingmar Bergman, De Sica, Fellini, Antonioni, Lelouch, Kurosawa, Truffaut, Renoir, Vertmuller, Bertolucci. They've given us stars like Lorraine, Mastroianni, Gassman, Bardot, Yves Montand, Liv Ullman, Toshiro Mifuni. They've given us innovations, technique, iconoclastic cinematic form, bold and graphic incursions into the deepest depths of the human soul. And you know what else they've done, Goldie? They've taken the bread right out of our mouths. <laughs> to present, whoops, <laughs> the award for best foreign <laughs> Oh, one of the most attractive and gifted players on the international screen today. A bilingual lady whom I just loved in Murder on the Orient Express and Francois Truffaut's Day for Night, Jacqueline Bissett. And with her, with her in what has become a distinguished tradition, a gentleman whose remarks will certainly be rated G, the president of the Motion Picture Association of America, Jack Valenti. A question, Jacqueline. What's the most wanted export of the United States? Well, considering the occasion, I'd wager it's the American movie. And you'd win. In more than 120 countries, the American film is this nation's most popular ambassador. And next to the president, who is the American most recognizable on any street, anywhere in the world? And the answer is the American movie star. Goldie and George pointed out that the American movie star is frequently British, French, Swedish, or Greek, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. Well, of course, and that's because talent knows no nationality. It's no accident, then, that the films we honor tonight are Russian, Polish, Mexican, Japanese, and Italian. Which reaffirms eloquently that the magic of the screen is international and boundless. And now to those splendid films of unusual excellence. The nominees for Best Foreign Language Film are... From the USSR, Der Su Yuzala. From Poland, The Land of Promise. From Mexico, Letters from Marussia. And from Japan, Sandakan Number no. 8. And from Italy, Scent of a Woman. And the winner is... The USSR for Desu Uchala. Accepting the award for Desu Uchala, Georgi Daniela, director. Yoichi Matsui, co-producer from Japan. Ladies and gentlemen, in the event that Mr. Kurosawa was honored by the Academy tonight, he has asked me in his behalf to read a statement for him, a statement that he has written. And this is what he says. May I take this opportunity to say a word to filmmakers throughout the world. In no other time in cinematic history has there been as much need as there is today for young power in the production of motion pictures. I will continue making films until my very last day. So young filmmakers throughout the world, please follow me and let us join hands and make good films together. Signed, Akira Kurosawa. very touched. Well, these Oscars uh, are very beautiful and a wonderful present uh, for all our staffs 
and the artists who have been working in good collaboration for two years. Thank you very much. I don't speak English, but thank you very much. Спасибо.